When the climbing season of 2019 started, a group of Army-skilled mountaineers began their expedition. Little did they know that fate had other plans for them, introducing the formidable Makalu, an awe-inspiring presence among the majestic Himalayan giants. Rising to an impressive height of 8,481 meters, it proudly claims the rank of the fifth highest peak on Earth. Makalu has earned a well-deserved reputation for its formidable challenges. Adding to the allure, Makalu finds its home in a remote and difficult-to-access region. Among these daring contenders, one individual stood out, Dipankar Ghosh, a 52-year-old Indian mountaineer with an impressive repertoire of successful ascents. Its impregnable summit remained unconquered until 1954 when audacious American climbers rose to the occasion. Subsequently, in the very next year, legendary French climbers Lionel Touré and Jean Cousy etched their names in history with a triumphant summit, marking a thrilling beginning to the peak's exploration. Following the daring ascent of Makalu in 1955, the mountain continued to captivate a select group of elite, high-level mountaineers renowned for their audacity. Fast forward to the spring Himalayan climbing season of 2019, where an expedition unfolded on Makalu's slopes. Amid this daring army of skilled mountaineers, an 18-man Indian Army expedition team embarked on an audacious journey making their way to the base camp with dreams of conquering this mighty peak. By early May, they were fully prepared for the momentous ascent, and they found themselves in the company of several smaller private expedition teams, all vying for the opportune weather window to conquer the summit. After enduring weeks of tough weather, the skies finally cleared, granting them the coveted chance they had long awaited. Among these daring contenders, one individual stood out, Dipankar Ghosh, a 52-year-old Indian mountaineer with an impressive repertoire of successful ascents. Having conquered peaks such as Kanch, Junga, Minasolu, Annapurna, Everest, and Dalugiri, along with a previous triumphant ascent of Makalu in 2013, Dipankar Ghosh had firmly established himself as a formidable force in the mountaineering world. Dipankar Ghosh, the intrepid mountaineer, joined forces with the esteemed Seven Summits tracks, embarking on what would undoubtedly be an adventure of a lifetime. Capitalizing on a favorable weather window, they seized the opportunity for the summit bid, knowing that the stars had aligned for their historic endeavor. Reaching the high camp on the evening of May 15th, Dipan Kargosh stood prepared for the monumental challenge that lay ahead. However, he soon discovered that the Indian Army Expedition Team, equally determined, was also poised to conquer the peak during the same opportune moment. On May 16, 2019, the climbers set out on their summit day journey. Braving the harsh and perilous conditions of the death zone, where the altitude surpasses 8,000 meters and the air becomes insufficient to sustain life for extended periods, Deepan Kargosh and his trusted Sherpa companion showcased unparalleled determination and resilience. Despite challenging conditions, including overcast skies and brisk winds, they forged ahead, undeterred by the adversities nature presented. Deepan Kargosh's remarkable Mount Makalu expedition took an unexpected turn, presenting him with a challenging decision as stormy weather loomed on the horizon. After thoughtful deliberation with the base camp team, he chose to press forward and set his sights on the summit, demonstrating his fearless determination. The final leg of the ascent proved to be an arduous and slow-paced endeavor, akin to racing against a snail's pace. With each hour, they meticulously inch just a few meters upward, navigating the demanding terrain with unyielding perseverance. However, a sudden disaster struck as Dipin Kargosh's Sherpa exhibited signs of altitude sickness, halting their progress a mere hundred meters away from the coveted summit. In a moment, 
the Sherpa made the difficult decision to descend to a safer altitude, leaving Dipankar Ghosh to face a pivotal choice. They encountered Narayan Singh from the Indian Army Expedition Team, who was confronting a similar predicament. Acting with selflessness and foresight, Dipan Kargosh made a resolute decision. He instructed his Sherpa to guide Singh back to Camp 4, ensuring their safety and a chance for recovery. Undeterred by the setback, Dipan Kargosh embarked on a solo summit push as the Indian Army team celebrated their achievement above. Confronting what felt like a wild war with Mother Nature, he achieved a moment of epic triumph by reaching the peak just before 4 p.m., savoring the taste of victory. However, the narrative took a drastic turn as he commenced his descent. The weather unleashed its fury, subjecting Dipan Kargosh to whiteout conditions and fierce winds, transforming his journey into a perilous roller coaster ride. Regrettably, he never returned to Camp 4 that evening, going missing during the treacherous descent. In the midst of this gripping mountain drama, Narayan Singh from the Indian Army team who had been battling altitude sickness and Daipan Kargosh's loyal Sherpa found their paths intertwined. Together, they journeyed back to Camp 4, both navigating the harrowing conditions and uncertainties that the mountain presented. The fate of Daipan Kargosh remained unknown, leaving the mountaineering community in suspense, eagerly awaiting news of his whereabouts. On May 17th, a heart-rending tragedy struck as Narayan Singh tragically passed away in his tent at Camp 4. The brave members of the Indian Army team discovered his lifeless body the following morning, marking a somber and poignant moment in this epic mountain tale. Amidst this heartache, the search for Deepon Kargosh intensified. A rescue team swiftly responded on the same fateful morning, racing against the harsh conditions that the mountain presented. However, with limited shelter along the summit ridge where Deepon Kargosh disappeared, the odds of a successful rescue seemed grim. His teammates, filled with deep concern, feared the possibility that he might have perished during the night, adding to the gravity of the situation. The quest to find Dupont Kargosh continued, with hope mingled with anxiety as the mountain held its secrets close. Despite the search and rescue team's unwavering determination, they faced a formidable challenge as the mountain's adverse weather conditions made it exceedingly difficult to locate any trace of Dupankar Gosh. After eight arduous days of relentless searching, a glimmer of hope emerged on May 24th when a team of 14 courageous Sherpas made a heart-wrenching discovery. They found Dupankar Gosh's remains buried beneath a snowy drift revealing that he had tragically succumbed to the cold during his descent. Amidst the tragedy, another sorrowful chapter unfolded. Nima Cheering Sherpa, a member of the search and rescue team, became separated from the group during the operation. He too encountered the merciless fury of the storm and tragically froze to death on Makalu's upper slopes. Dipan Kargosh was revered as a legend in his own right a selfless, amiable individual always ready to extend a helping hand to others. He exemplified the true essence of a mountain hero, displaying extraordinary courage and self-sacrifice. One noteworthy incident that showcased his altruism was during a climb on Palagiri, where he fearlessly rescued a struggling member of the Indo-Tibetan police expedition after a grueling night on the mountain. The loss of Dipan Kargosh and Nima Cheering Sherpa left an indelible mark on the mountaineering fraternity, highlighting the risks and sacrifices that mountaineers willingly undertake while pursuing their passion for conquering nature's formidable peaks. As the mysteries of the mountain unfold, we encounter a legendary hero boasting an impressive 25 years of mountaineering experience earning him an esteemed status among climbers. Yet to truly understand his journey, let's delve into his past climbs. Despite being explicitly cautioned, he fearlessly pursued several late afternoon summits of other eight zero 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 meter peaks, 
defying the odds with remarkable determination. His ability to weather such challenges like a true champion demonstrated his capability to conquer stormy heights. However, on that fateful day, perhaps he succumbed to summit fever, unable to resist the irresistible allure of Makalu's peak. Pressing on despite the rapidly changing weather, he pursued the summit like a fearless warrior in pursuit of glory. Regrettably, that decision resulted in tragic consequences. Safety must always remain paramount. As we honor the courageous souls who dared to ascend to new heights, let us also remember the inherent risks that come with such undertakings. With that said, thank you for watching. Be sure to hit that subscribe button and stay tuned for more.